again? She didn't hear you. Are you a piece of food for the Easter hunt? For the Easter hunt? Yes. She said you look beautiful. Thank you. Malia, why are you dressed like a bunny today? Because it's Easter. Because it's Easter. And what are you getting ready to do today? Um, eat some chocolate. <laughs> but first, do you have an Easter egg hunt? Yes. 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 And yes. how many eggs are you going to try and find today? Um, one million. One eggs. million. So we have to basically collect all the eggs. Yes. Yes. Are you ready for this? <laughs> I'm ready. Still waking <laughs> up. As far as I remember, last year was a competition between parents, not kids. Pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> I think there's going to be more more aggression this year from these lot. <laughs> A bit more aware. Malia is a year older, so I think she'll uh, she'll be sharp. Malia, you need to make sure that you are sharp today. Yeah. We do some do some warm ups. Yeah, we're gonna do a warm up. Some reaction drills. <laughs> do some like push ups. <laughs> yeah, that's it. That's it. That's the one. So some of you actually said that you want to see Malia more in videos. Here we go. Today is Malia's day. Are you ready to take over the vlog? No? <laughs> Are you ready to eat all the chocolate? Yeah! Yeah! But did you know why Edna... <laughs> Mine's not as exciting as yours. your Easter breakfast. I'm not that hungry actually. <laughs> just need some protein and... You just always eat the same thing. It's though, true. I'm Mr. Mr. Predictable when yeah. it comes to my yeah. food. What are your carbs? Are they after? I'll have some fruit after. Okay. Alright. And chocolate? <laughs> mm -mm. So what did mommy say about you and chocolate today? Uh, I can have whatever I want. Yeah, you can eat all the chocolate you want today. I'm quite Is intrigued it? to see how she feels. Mm, she'll make herself very sick. <laughs> she doesn't have this kind of freedom no, but you know usually. what? Actually, she's pretty good. Usually when we've given her lots of sweets and chocolates before, she'll have just what she wants and then she'll say, no, thank you, I've had enough. You remember, yes. like... Yeah, we don't actually restrict her at all. But we do kind of limit how many pieces. We don't is restrict it? her, no, but no, we no, limit her. No, you know what I mean. Like we don't, we don't say, okay, no chocolate. Like she, she can have a sweet or a chocolate uh, every day, pretty much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And she only usually will have a couple before she just says that's enough. So it's challenge good. is on. Especially if she's having muffin for breakfast. She might not be that, that like up for chocolates. Let's see. Go again. Where are you going, little bunny? Hi! <laughs> so Malia's copy and the bun faces. Malia, can you do that one now? <laughs> That's quite accurate actually. Okay Malia, and the last one, you're going to be an egg. <laughs> Push that down. Good job. You can show mommy how to do that as well. <laughs> now you have to get on the bike. Okay, turn, turn the key. Yeah, and ignition. Ignition. She's a pro. We are now going to Ocean Sports. Basically, all the families are meeting up at Ocean Sports every year uh, for the egg hunt, and they do a lunch buffet and things. We're not sure if we're going to stay for lunch, but we can't miss the opportunity for Malia to go hunting for Easter eggs. So. And that's my broken horn. <laughs> okay, let's go. Okay. Are you ready for this? I want ready. <laughs> She's off. She got her Bye. Ready. Malia, show me your basket. Massimo. Are you ready? Yes. Ready to find some eggs? Keep looking. <laughs> She's walking straight into it. Right in front. Malia, look for eggs. Look in front of you. In front of you. You keep it in there.
Amalia, show me, show me how many eggs you got. Look. I have magic one. Oh my gosh. Two magic ones. Two magic, magic eggs. I wonder what those ones will do. I can't believe you're doing this to me. This is Sammy. Say hi. 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 Hi, everyone. Can't believe you're doing this to me, Ina. Thank you for producing some of the best Watamu contents I've ever seen. You're very welcome. It was great to meet you. It was great to meet you too. What's for lunch? Mm, pasta. It's for what? Pasta. pasta? I don't think so. Look at this big pizza. Is this one just for you? Yeah, only yours. Alright, so we've had um, the best pizza in Montana before. I think this one's the biggest, right? So this one is 2,000 shillings for the seafood or 1,100 for the half. But if you want like a big one, come to Ocean Sports. How's the pizza? <laughs> <laughs> Are you filming? Yes. Uh, <laughs> How was the egg hunt? Great. Did you enjoy it? Yeah, it was fun. It's always fun. She got lots of eggs. Uh, I kept it quite calm today, I was just pointing things out for her. Yeah, last year she needed a lot more help. This year it was just kind of like, oh, why don't you just walk over there and have a look around and she would find them by herself. What's the plan? We're just going to go home. Uh, back to... Well, the balloon's doing a fart. Okay, we have to watch her doing a fart first. No, my balloon's doing a fart. <laughs> Good job. Uh, Great. Back home for some quiet time. And then uh, this evening, Temple Point are doing a barbecue buffet, so we're looking forward so to checking that out. Basically, today is just eating. It's just food, basically eating. chocolate, food. It's just kind some of a more day food, in the life and maybe kind some more vlog. chocolate at the end. A day in the life kind of vlog, would you I mean, I wouldn't say we have like this much chocolate and food every day, but yeah. We thought, um, as the the day got a little bit rained off today, um, so we thought we would take the opportunity to just talk a little bit more about our trip that is coming up in two weeks time which we're very, getting very excited about it's also a very um, quite a hard trip to plan um, but yeah basically the plan is this Sunwell Safaris have very kindly given us two of their vehicles with rooftop tents which we've also never done before Barely done camping before. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, literally, Ina's first experience of camping was Egypt. Yeah. Um, and that was two nights. This that was cool though. I think, you know, if you make your first camping experience somewhere epic, take it. But we also had drivers, we had people that were setting up the tents for us, we had people cooking True, our food, easy tenting. preparing tea for us. Like, we did nothing on that <laughs> trip. By the way, can we quickly mm. sell this trip as well? The escape. The Egypt yeah. one, yeah. <laughs> that. So we have an escape literally launching on Friday. It means this video uh, will be out after. So basically we'll link it all up below, but we have an adventure escape, which is going to be 10 days long in Egypt. Yeah, still tweaking it a little bit now. So it'll either be, yeah, it's likely going to be nine nights, 10 days. Um, exploring Egypt with in us. In November, this November. And yeah, November coming and it's epic. We're gonna take people into Cairo to explore, you know, the ancient pyramids. We're gonna jump into cars and drive into the desert where we'll stay with Bedouins and camp, which is just what we were talking about there. We stay in the middle of the desert in tents and it's just, it's super cool. We go sandboarding, uh, dune driving. Um, then we fly to Sinai, 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 Sinai. Dahab. Basically, we go to Dahab where you guys will get the chance to rock climb, free dive, quad biking through the valleys, um, lots of cool, cool stuff. Like Egypt, this. the way we did it is really, really cool. People tend to think of Egypt as like, oh, pyramids, you know. Mm -hmm. um, there's so much to Egypt, and obviously, Egypt is quite big, so you have to kind of 
pick your location as to where you want to explore, but mm. what we've done is we've done three locations in one trip. Anyway, we've got sidetracked. <laughs> Let's get back that's to the okay. Kenya trip. Egypt, come to Egypt with come us. Come to anyway. Egypt with us. Um, but our adventure coming up um, is going to be a lot of fun. It's, yeah, it's going to be, it's basically 10 days that we're, that we're away. But yeah. it's not 10 days on the road. It's 10 days, we'll from fly. The point we start in Nairobi, right? Yeah, we're going to yeah. fly from the coast into Nairobi. We're going to spend a day getting some gear because we don't have any waterproofs. It's now, it's going to be May. What? Uh, yeah, we're going north. So it's going to be cold <laughs> and wet. And we have only coastal stuff. But yeah, the first day is just going to be us kind of getting ready. And I'm actually excited because... Um, we're gonna try and hit a gym, go to a supermarket, go to uh, Decathlon, we, Decathlon yeah. uh, stop by Love the head office shop. at uh, Sun World. Maybe we can introduce the the owners and um, lots of cool stuff actually. So yeah, and we're gonna be we're gonna be day. documenting this whole trip. We we are doing this trip for you. Um, so for us too. <laughs> maybe <laughs> not just for them. Shh, they don't need to know that. And then we set off. We meet up. Um, with Dave and Tracy, and we were both going our vehicles. The plan so far, it's quite a vague plan. We're still polishing it. Is to kind of drive that way. <laughs> um, I, would, I would say day one is going to be driving to sort of Nanuki area. Uh, we'll spend a couple of days around that kind of region, I would think, because you've got, um, I'm probably going to butcher the name now, Ndare Ngare. Forest. I think you did well, yeah. Ndarangare yeah. Forest. It has the blue, is it like the a blue, blue lagoon? The blue lagoon that you can swim in and things like that. We're I'm also that just Even so... Even if it's cold, I'm doing it. Yeah, for sure, I'm down. We also just so happen to be in the region that Ina knows somebody from a tribe in like Kipia who has very kindly offered to to have us stay with their, their tribe. I'm very excited um, about that. So we're gonna camp there overnight. But that's deep in like Kipia, like that is yeah. literally like the furthest. And then- Like that kind of stuff really does excite me. If you guys have any um, recommendations around the Nanyuki area, uh, or even the plan is then, once we've done that bit, to continue towards Samburu, um, and uh, yeah, go go camp by go camp in in Samburu National Park, um, which is also going to be very exciting. But we we don't. If you have good camping recommendations, please comment down below. That's the main thing. Like the other stuff, we can kind of explore. If there are parks or conservancies that you think hands down the best place you've ever visited, please comment down below. Restaurants in Nanuki that we should go to. We've already had a few recommendations or if you yourself live up that way and you think you could show us something amazing and you want to be part of our vlog. Um, or even if you own a business like a restaurant and you want to... Some free promo. Us. Yeah, why not? We'll stop by, grab some food and then get going. Um, yeah, so anything that you guys think that you can do to guide us. Um, so yeah, that's the plan to head up that way. This is our biggest trip we've done in Kenya, like we would have done in Kenya mm. since being here, right? Yeah, we've yeah. only ever flown, like gone somewhere. Like we just go from A to B Five and that's days? that's the place. But no, Usually? I just I just mean Yeah, generally. we just do one stop. We haven't done like a multi-location thing. We just usually go from A to B and that's yeah. the location. Yeah. This is the first time that not only are we going to be on the road for more than a week, but we are just completely free to go wherever we want. And um, it's... Very cool. Yeah, I think we should wrap it up here so this vlog doesn't end up being too long. But yeah. um, as usual, thank you for tuning in. Sorry, it wasn't overly adventurous. It was just like a day in the life of day, Easter, yeah. a rainy, wet Easter day. <laughs> we hope you had a nice Easter. And yeah, if you did enjoy it, please support the channel. Give it a like. If you're not subscribed already, which around 60-70% of you are not subscribed, please subscribe. Mm -hmm and help our channel to grow, which is growing very slowly. Uh, <laughs> like there's people with these huge channels, help us grow, Show, tell your friends, write a comment down below and um, stay tuned for our adventure. See you later. Bye. <laughs> Ouch. Ow.